the idea that you know the reason that they that it was Paul Heyman that got them cut and not Vince McMahon is yes. Uh, essentially, the story, if you didn't hear it, is that they said that they. I guess there was like a list, and allegedly Paul Heyman put them on the list of people that would be cut, and AJ Styles apparently went to Vince McMahon, and Vince McMahon claimed, well, I didn't have him on my list, pal. And so, you know, AJ got very upset at Paul Heyman and demanded that he be moved to SmackDown, and I guess... I I have to say something about this, because I'm actually like really pissed off um, at AJ Styles, because last week, AJ Styles did a video... And the, what happened and what they said is exactly what I reported, you know, that AJ Styles got mad because um, he thought that Paul Heyman was the, the reason that Gals and Anderson got cut and he demanded to move to SmackDown. Um, that's what I reported. And AJ Styles said that and he just goes, Dave Meltzer's a liar and he just makes things up. And it's just like, I was going to say something that week, but I had heard that these guys were going to do this video and I pretty much was told that they're going to tell the truth on the video, and I knew what the truth was. So basically, what AJ Styles said that I was a liar about and that I made something up was exactly what his friends said word for word, basically, other than the fact that I said that they're incredibly naive to believe that it wasn't Vince McMahon's decision, because it was. But the point is, is that the, but I did say that AJ Styles blamed Paul Heyman and asked to be switched brands over it which is exactly what they said so anyway um and that's actually the second time that that he's done that um the other time was um when um you know he had a had an injury and i got you know i basically got you know as, as you know the injury wwe has an injury list and i said what his injury was from the wwe's injury list from the wwe and he said that like i was a liar and it's just like um, well, I got it from WWE and a couple people in WWE and one person who's another reporter who had actually who also knew about the list just goes like if he was so mad, he needed to yell and, and say WWE, you know, got my injury wrong or WWE doctor screwed up. You don't say Dave Meltzer lied, you know, but that 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 just tells you about AJ Styles right there. So anyway, I just wanted to get that off my chest because um you know, you can say anything you want about me, but do not say that I'm a liar because um, I'm not and I won't be and I can't be doing this business. You know, I mean, that's the one thing I can't be. And if I'm wrong on a on a story, I'll always, uh, you know, whatever. I'll always tell you that I'm wrong later if I make a mistake, which isn't nearly that often right now. And anyway, so uh, but I'm, I'm th that was just total bullshit, you know, especially because it was like a week ago when he said it in that video. And so anyway. That's let me. That's that's enough of that on AJ. Um, well, anyway, the gist of all of this is this is the story. This has been the story for forty years now. If you get fired, it's Pat because Patterson, of Vince. JJ Dillon. If you get fired, it's because of Vince. And I mean, here, here's the thing. Let's just say, let's just say Paul Heyman. You know, Paul Heyman. Number one, Paul Heyman doesn't have the power to make those decisions, and those decisions were all made by Vince. Okay, but let's just say that. Um, Vince was asking Paul Heyman and just goes, um, you know, who, who can you not use? And he said, Gallows and Anderson. And Vince wanted to, you know, if Vince wanted to keep them, he'd move them to SmackDown, yes. which he didn't do. Okay. Or if Vince, you know, you know, it, it, it's a hundred percent Vince's call. Um, and so, I mean, like the whole thing now, I mean, like, look, they have the right to say, you know, Paul Heyman said he was going to push us. And and he didn't, even though, you know, they did he did give them the um, that tournament win in Saudi Arabia and the best in the world tournament. He did give them the tag team titles once. But here's the reality. OK, Paul Heyman was, you know, I mean, we he was going to push 50 guys. What? He was going to push 50 different guys. Well, no, the thing with Paul Heyman is, is like Paul Heyman um, on Raw, his thing was that he was going to push young guys, and they were not young guys. 